Hey everybody, it's Karen and Paul with Food and Family. How's everybody been? Um, we've been excited about coming on and visiting with everyone tonight. I'm gonna try to get my laptop going here so I can try to read some comments and um, interact with you because I don't always hear it is. I can't see the phone in it that far away. So, here we go. What's everybody been doing today? We got out and we ran a few errands and had some lunch and just had a good time being mm. together today. The weather's been so-so today. It's been beautiful sunshine, but um, it's been cool-ish. But um, anyway... I just want to hear from you. Where are you at? Tell us where you are. Tell us where you are. I'm not seeing. I know the comments are coming in up there, but I'm not seeing them on my laptop yet. Oh, there they are. I'm, I'm looking you, in the wrong place. Just up. <laughs> I was looking up under it yeah. when it, they're on the side. Good evening, AJ, Terry, Kansas City. Um, hey, Linda, how are you doing? Um, Georgia, Seed, Soil, and Sunshine, South Carolina, Lavanda, Michigan, Del Rio, West Virginia, Kentucky, Opelika, Alabama. That's a home, Atmore, Alabama. We, we go through Atmore quite a bit uh, when we go to the beach, but we haven't been down in a few years. Louisiana. Indiana, New Zealand. Hey, New Zealand. Um, AJ, thank you. She says she loved the macaroni and cheese video. Can't wait to try it in upstate New York. Um, yeah, we love macaroni and cheese. Isn't it a wonderful comfort food? And I don't think you can have too much cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I don't either. No, Massachusetts, Virginia, Georgia, South Carolina. We've got everybody on here tonight. I think we have all states uh, covered. Hey, Viola. Uh, how are you? Um, yeah, some of my fellow YouTube friends are on here with us. Viola and Linda. And uh, hey, Joan. How are you and Bill doing? Mississippi. I was just in Mississippi this um First of this week, and uh, just went over there and spent the day with a friend of mine, and uh, we came back the next day, so it was a lot of fun, a lot of fun. So, what do you say? We get to the business. Go ahead. We get down to business. We have our first giveaway. Where's your phone? I need you to... Help me with this. We're going to give this to away it. tonight. We're not going to wait. Um, the last time we did a giveaway, we waited, and we're not going to do that today. Yeah, excuse me. I had a little tickle in my throat, so I'd have some water. We have this stainless steel have bottle. This stainless steel. Isn't it big? <laughs> You think it'll hold enough? It's a 64 ounce. And this is what we're going to give away. I love the colors because they're kind of close to what I like. Um, you know, that's my logo. But it's a little bluer, but I just loved it. I thought it was so pretty. And we wanted to give this away tonight. And some of you have seen my new logo for the shirts, and uh, I hope you can see that. We can. And uh, oh yeah, you can see it. You can see it. My daughter-in-law, one of our daughter-in-laws, not Stephanie, but the other daughter-in-law, Carrie, she designed that logo mm -hmm. for me. She's my behind-the-scenes crew, and uh, she designed that. And it's got the food and the family, and it's got the YouTube channel name up under it so um i know several people have asked about us selling it and they, there are things that i've got in place we're working on in order for me to be able to sell things and uh that's still in the works 
but um, unfortunately, sometimes it's a little process. So, who have we got here tonight? We've got 63 with us. Pennsylvania, Long Beach. Judy, thank you. We, I've been with him for 47 years, so I think we make a good couple. What do you think? How long? <laughs> 47 years. <laughs> Stephanie, are you on here? Hey, Joan Card, <laughs> just move away from Alabama and go to East Tennessee Mountains. That's right. We miss y'all. Heather's on here in Montana. That's our niece. And um, Hey, Heather. We're still wanting to get up there to see him. We keep talking about it, and we just talked about it a little <laughs> bit again today. So, Heather, we will make it up there one day soon. Uh, water bottle makes you smile, Terry. It is a pretty water bottle. I, 64 ounces. Can you imagine? That's a lot. That's a lot of liquid. But you know if you're traveling... That would be the right amount. And uh, it's supposed to keep it cold for 24 hours. And it says it has a sipper. Oh, I guess it's made into, it's a straw yep. that's made into the cow. Mm -hmm. Straw and chug for water intake. Oh. Chug a lug. Oh, flip straw for sipping, it says. Okay. I guess I should have read it a little better, huh? It's dishwasher safe. <laughs> Is it dishwasher mm -hmm. safe? It wouldn't That's fit on pretty. my top of my dishwasher rack. <laughs> We'd have to put it on the bottom. Yeah, holds up to eight cups. That's the same color as my boat. Maybe well, I, it is. It, maybe I'll win it. <laughs> maybe you'll win it, or we'll have to go get you one. It is the same color as his boat, and he's wanting to go fishing. Yeah, this weather has got Too to turn, cold. and springtime get here. And uh, yes, Angela, we can put some sweet tea in it. Uh, springtime get here so he can go fishing and we can get out this summer. And uh, I like to sit on back in the boat and read, but our grandson, Parker, whom y'all have all seen, he likes to go fishing too. So him and his papa get out and go fishing. Uh, Doug Carter, thank you. I enjoy, I, I wish I could just have every one of you here with me, but. Um, you should have seen the pile of chicken liver she ate today. Oh, I didn't eat that many. <laughs> <laughs> no, we went to Lloyd's restaurant on Highway 280. 280, yeah, yeah here in Alabama. And you can probably look them up. Mm. I don't know, but. They've been there so long. Oh, they have. They have. I won't cook chicken livers anymore. I love them, but they pop when I cook them. So if anybody knows a good method that I can cook them, I've heard that if you pierce them before you cook them, they won't do that. I've tried it. It didn't work. But uh, if anybody knows a, um, a good way, because I get hot grease popped out on my arms, all the time. Yeah, the whole Dr. Pepper too. <laughs> That's Melissa Lee. Yes. Oh. Oh, Stephanie's in here with us. Good Stephanie. Yeah, she's talking back and forth with some of them. She's got some fans also. Isn't she? <laughs> no, she she's my daughter-in-law, my daughter-in-love, but she just should be my daughter. I just, that's how she is, Jamie. <laughs> And um, I think you guys know and have seen her enough by now. And we had some comments on our last video. She held out her arm and I pushed her sleeve up. We have our own sign language. And we don't even have to talk. We can just speak with each other. And she says, I need some of this. And so I get her tongs. And that's exactly what she wanted. So... Uh, but we do. We have our own our own language, so to speak. So I'm looking at you guys, and then I'm looking at my computer, and it's it's a delay. So I have to look at one yeah, or the other. <laughs> so what do you say? We've got seventy two. We got seventy people on. Um, Sharon, we enjoy doing. Um, videos together she has some wonderful ideas and i tease all the time i said i'm just the face and uh she runs it she really does she keeps me in line and she does a lot of planning she does a lot of things for me that um 
I just call her and say, I need so-and-so. And she says, I'm on it. And she takes care of it for me. Or she goes and does research and mm -hmm. finds all these things for us. So she's uh, she's a big help to us. I taste test most of the time. <laughs> taste test is the best part of it. He is the taste and I tester. And I um, do this and do that. Yes, Clarissa, you're... Uh, <clears throat> Your cousin, is that correct? Yes, uh, we do love Viola's channel, don't we? Uh, and Linda, love easy cooking with Linda. Linda B, y'all look her up too. And uh, she has a lot of good videos and so does Viola. And uh, Viola's Baked and Cooked Delight, so y'all check her out as well. But, okay, so what do you say? We've got 85 people. You want to do a drawing? Sure. Let's do the um, let's do the water bottle. I need... Well, it's a Dr. Pepper bottle for one of them. Dr. Pepper bottle, yeah. sweet Stainless tea. Stainless steel bottle. Sweet tea to hold yeah. anything. We can put it, fill it up with some sweet tea and take it out on the boat, can't we? You know, I did the craziest thing. He brought me a cup of coffee. This evening, I'm at my desk, and I've got my computer on. I've got two computers in there and a big monitor, and I'm going through stuff, and I spilt my coffee. I just turned it right over, so I'm having to scream, help. It didn't get on my carpet, though, thankfully. All right, so we're going to draw for this stainless steel bottle. You ready? Yes. We're going to do this, and y'all sit that. here and watch him. We're just going to scroll, stop, pick a name without yeah. even looking. I want to do it up and down uh, three times, and then whichever name is on the top. Yeah, kind of like mixing yeah. up all yeah. the cards in hat. Do Let's times. do that. Try to do it without watching. Yeah. <laughs> got to watch. You have to do three. I'll let it stop. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So who've we got? Terry Mentor. Terry. Yes. She loves to watch Stephanie. She does. <laughs> T E R R I M I N T E R. Okay. You're the winner of the stainless steel bottle. Yes. Okay, Terry, don't we'll need your address, but do not put it on here. Email it to us. And I'll, my emails are in the description boxes of my videos, but I'm going to give it to you. Email it to me at KJ, the letters, all letters, KJNPJ2020 at gmail.com. In fact, I'm going to type it in right here. She said, wow. <laughs> <laughs> um. KJNPJ20 at gmail.com. So, email me <clears throat> your address, so, but please, yep. no addresses out on here. No P.O. box, unless you got a big one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, I'll need a, um, uh, a street address for this. So, and we'll get this out. This is Saturday. It'll be next week before I can get it out. Did you write that down? I did. Okay. I did. And now we want to draw for the shirt. And the same thing was emailed <laughs> for the address and for the size. I have sizes. Um, no small, no medium. No small or medium. The only mediums I have are the gray. Yeah. And that's the old logo, and we have um, large, extra large, 2X and 3X. And I kind of decided not to do small and mediums because um, I never really had a call for the gray ones. And, um, you know, excuse me, you're probably hearing an alarm. I've got to see it. This is... Um, let me see if I can get it to go off. You still there? I'm sorry. I thought I had turned off my alarm. And uh, I guess I didn't. 
Okay, so we're ready to draw for, the, for shirt. the shirt. There we yes, go. Yes, here we're going for the okay. shirt. Mm. I hope it's spinning. I'll watch it. It is. Last one. It go. is. Okay. Went to uh, Dearly Beloved. Dearly Beloved. Congratulations, Dearly Beloved. Okay, well, Dearly Beloved, send us your address and your size and uh, an email. Again, I put it in here. It's KJ Dearly and PJ20 at gmail.com. And give me your shirt size and mm -hmm. address. And... Um, I'll get it out. Oh, she's in West Virginia. West Virginia. <clears throat> All right. Well, that's great. Lorla, yeah, we're working on getting some, there's a few things that I've got. I'm working with my accountant that we can get things set up so we can start selling and um, selling these shirts. I've had several requests and they are wonderful shirts. What's your next um, video out? The next one, we just put macaroni and cheese out, and that's been a huge hit. Thanks, everybody, for watching that and commenting. And Stephanie and I did game day foods. We did Super Bowl foods. So I'm going to work on that one and try to have it out tomorrow. <clears throat> and I think you're going to love it. We did uh, fried pickles. Stephanie fried mozzarella cheese sticks. And we made some, we named them H&T sandwiches. It's uh, ham and turkey mm -hmm. sandwiches. And uh, we put all kind of goodies on it and baked them they in the so oven. Good. Oh, they were delicious. Uh, that and, and cheese sticks. Oh, they were. And the mm. pull on that cheese when she fried those mm. up, it's just, oh, it was so good. And um, yeah, aren't they going to love it? Said Stephanie, they were so good. And I think we surprised ourselves on those, but we're going to have that out. Joanne from uh, Canada just made your macaroni and cheese. Really? How'd you like it, Joanne? Oh, from Calgary. I, I bet it is cold where you're at. I bet it is cold where you're at. Um, thank you, music girl. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. We yeah, I hope they like it. <laughs> so we have 100 people on here and only 28 likes. Yeah. We so um, Give us a thumbs up. Yeah. Yeah. Give us a thumbs up or give us hearts and uh, let us know you're on here with us. Well, we know you are. We see you. We, um, I forgot what I was going to hey, say. That macaroni and cheese, y'all. Yeah. Mm. It was so cheesy. I had, well, I say three kinds of cheese, but I put four on the top because I added Parmesan. <laughs> <laughs> and it was, I think I had more cheese in it than I did macaroni, but it was, can you go wrong? Can you have too much Cold cheese? in South Carolina. There's Bruce's Smoke Shack. Bruce's that's a, Smoke Shack. That's our son. He's a grill master. Yeah, I'll help us talk him into doing a... YouTube channel because he is fabulous on the grill. And my comment stopped. Here we go. They picked up. Hey, Chef Jason. Um, yes, maybe a cookbook soon. I've gotten started on one. You'd think since I'm retired that um, I would have all day just to do that, but really I don't. I stay busier than I did when I was actually mm -hmm. working. Kevin said, uh, miss your cream corn. Oh, she does Kevin make the here? best cream corn. Yeah. Uh, oh, I love, he loves my fried corn. And well, we call it fried corn, but um, that my granny always made it and it was the best thing. What are you cooking, Chef Jason? Chef Jason has a YouTube Mr. channel. Mr. Haywood. Mm-hmm. And he Just has some great... Just wonder what he's cooking tonight. We might want to go eat Yeah, with him. he has some great videos. Um, uh, 
I'm from Tennessee. Robin, we love Tennessee. Um, my son and I was up there, was it three weeks ago now? We went to Harriman, Tennessee, and you guys have seen me up there before with my brother, Craig, and we loved the little town, and we walk around. Well, Chris, our oldest son, had never been, so he and I just took off and went up there and spent the day and um, got up the next morning and ventured around town. It was raining. Yeah, some of us have to work. And... Uh, <laughs> But it's just beautiful. We both talked about how easily we could so easily live in East Tennessee. We just love it. Um, Tabs Jennings, I'm sorry you have to run. Host to you. Um, we just love everybody. Oh, Chef Jason made gumbo today in his love restaurant. Gumbo. Chris, my, our son Chris makes the gumbo, and I have a video of him doing it. It's a process, isn't it, Jason? Um, that's not something you can make quick and easy. I can do jambalaya, and it's like a, a quick version, and have it, you know, start to finish in 30 minutes. And I know that's just a, a quick and dirty, but it is so good. Nancy? Turn, turnips to tangerines. Turnips to That's a catchy name there. Oh, I see <laughs> that. Northern tangerines. Wisconsin. Twisted Art that? Lady. Oh, uh, Dallas. Nancy you, says she's made many of my recipes and never been disappointed. Yeah, that makes me feel so good when I hear you say that. Um, it just really, it, it does. It makes me feel good. So anyway, I'm not going to keep you any longer. We did. We just wanted to come on. And, um, oh, Jason said his family's from Louisiana, so he does a lot of Cajun food. Mm -hmm. um, Jason, we might need to collab sometime. I'll get Chris on here. <laughs> We're wanting to do a red beans and rice, but we need a really good recipe. If you can send me one, I'd appreciate it. You can email it to me. I won't give it away. Maybe I will. <laughs> that is going to make your Mardi Gras cake soon. Oh, yeah, the Mardi Gras cake. It was an earthquake Mardi Gras cake. We made that last year when we did the gumbo. It was so easy. It wasn't the typical Mardi Gras cake, but it was so good. It was so, so good. Um Crabby McCrab face, yes, you're good and jumping in and out. Have a great weekend. Good night, Joyce. Um, no cookbook yet, but I am pushing her. Nancy, I, I can't push, even push. begin to tell you. Like I said, I have stayed so much busier now that I'm retired and doing this full time than I was working. But it's always something to do and get prepared, shopping you know, getting stuff together. So I tell him, and my work hours are different now than he is. So <laughs> <laughs> I'm usually videoing, shopping in the morning, videoing in the afternoon, mm. and sitting at the computer at mm. night. So uh, it changed a little bit, but it really, it's something I love, and I'm so much more happier doing this. So... Anyway, Nancy, as soon as we know, we get an idea, um, I'm going to let everybody know. I promise you that. Uh, all right. Hey, Parker. 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 We love you, too. That's our grandson. Um, and you guys have seen him. He does the peanut butter cake, and we've got to get him back up here. He has another bread that he likes to do. Um Terry said she's not going to be able to sleep tonight thinking about a water bottle. <laughs> Terry, I'm going to give said, it to you. She said, tell Stephanie hello from the land of Oz in Kansas. <laughs> Stephanie's on here, so she read it. Yes, yes. Anyway, everyone, please have a good, good night. And um, I'm so glad we got to do this tonight. So we're going to try to get you to do it again soon. And we love and appreciate every single one of you, and we hope to talk soon. Bye, everybody. Good night, all. <laughs>